Hey there friends, how's it going? My name is Kevin and today we're playing Harry Potter and the Prisoner of Azkaban. I feel like I'm going to a Harry Potter exclusive channel and I'm okay with that. <laughs> I've played this recently because we're trying to make our way through it. We did the Lego creator thing which I don't know if you could even call a game and now we're back on this but I hope you're enjoying it because I really love these games. They're really quirky. And I think it's um, time to turn in. Ron's talking over me again. I'm Gonna punch him in the throat. <laughs> Is that a spell? But yeah, I hope you've been enjoying, because I know I have been. And uh, let's start it off by ending the day. <laughs> Gryffindor is in the lead. God, no one really cares, do they? <laughs> no hype at all. <laughs> it seems like they're not putting any effort in. Like you could at least give him a whoop de doo or something. Like he gathered everyone just to celebrate. The history of magic classroom on the fourth floor. Professor Lupin sent me a note. Do you ever think like Harry talks like he's a cop? Because that's what I'm getting. <laughs> he just seems like he's not fitting in quite well. And just the way he enunciates everything. I don't know. It's it's weird. I think he's undercover. Wait, I'm going to the boys' dormitory. I think I took a wrong turn. Ah, well, I'll show Hermione what it's like. She's never seen it before. We need to go to the fourth floor. Okay, uh, Hermione, I took you in here as a privilege. You don't need to shout and wake everyone up. Why am I even going to the class in the middle of the night? Like, the dude who's teaching me the spells is a werewolf. It's kind of dangerous, if anything. <laughs> Ah oh, yes, the old Weasley touch. I forgot about that. Oh my god, <laughs> I think Harry has uh, experienced it before. He backed away very quick there. Wait, shortcut to the- did I just go back up to the seventh floor? <laughs> that Weasley touch never ends up going well for anyone. You know, it is kind of special actually, the Weasley touch. Like, he pushed on that and it slid out of the way. <laughs> I don't really understand. There is something magic about it. It's not what his victims would say though. Come on! I'm trying, just, I'm the one in front. A creature that assumes the form of the thing you most fear, which for you, Harry, is that of a Dementor. <laughs> Imagine if it were me. It would be like a little Ford Fiesta, the car that hit me. <laughs> what do you do to that? What spell works on that? Oh, I'm alone now. I don't have uh, Ron or anything to help me out. This should be easy. <laughs> I need to further. I know, I know. You gotta get lower back pain in your early teens to get the spell. <laughs> I know the memo at this point. Can we all just take a moment to appreciate that this is inside his closet? Like, that's insane. This is a bigger story than Narnia being in someone's closet. Most people's closets are just filled with clothes or their sexuality. Okay, I'm glad my closet isn't like this. Imagine every time you want to get a new jacket having to go through this. Okay, a lot of people have got lost in here looking for jackets, I think. <laughs> What the hell is that? Oh, my jacket! <laughs> Why is it flying like that? Wait, he's letting it at me and I don't even have a spell to defend myself yet? I don't know how to defend myself from it. What's the point in this? Great. Not really sure how a Boggart even has all the abilities of a Dementor. I didn't think that's what Boggarts did. I thought they just, you know, replicated the effect of being a Dementor, not actually being able to suck out my soul. The Dementor just waiting patiently in the cutscene. He's a nice man, really. Look at him, he's leaving me. <laughs> I appreciate it, dude. <laughs> Who just told him to take me and run? <laughs> Who is against me here? <laughs> the mentors are bros. <laughs> it comes down to it. He's just not attacking me half the time. Oh my god, Harry keeps falling over. Anytime like I do something good in a game, I'm like, Oh, did you see that? Look how good I am at games. And then if I do something bad, I'm like, Why does Harry keep falling? <laughs> I just blame the character. Okay, I'm out of here, Dementor bro. I'll see you later. As much of a nice guy as he was, I don't really want to hang out with him anymore. Mainly because he kills me when I go near him. It's kind of tragic. Magic, really. Oh, was that it? I get the spell? That wasn't too bad. I mean, it was feckin' horrible, but, <laughs> but it wasn't long, is what I'm trying to say. What the hell was that? New sound effect for when the menu opens, I guess. Aha! Dementor Bro is defeated. Oh, wait, hold on. Oh, no. He, he won anyway. <laughs> he won by Kamikaze. Remus? Oh, Severus? I am... He's nervous because he's like, oh god, I've been hanging out with three children in the dead of night, oh no. <laughs> I'm afraid you will have to make your own way back. Look at that, it's not my fault you're hanging out with kids in the middle of the night. Why do I have to sneak away? I can't stand Snape. I'm pretty sure the guy can hear you, by the way. Stop trash talking him. <laughs> he thought it just went, Remus? <laughs> and we heard him. How are we going to get there before the next potions class? The map shows. <laughs> the camera turns away and he's just holding the massive map all of a sudden. Wait, hold on. Where'd the pervert go? We just got abandoned all of a sudden. I'm just gonna go outside. Oh, God knows what he got. Using the old Weasley touch. Where the hell am I? <laughs> I ended up in the hospital somehow. Uh, story of my life. Literally, have you seen the draw my life? <laughs> 
That's pretty much it. Snipe. Dude, stop talking so loudly. He is right next to you. Do they think he's deaf? Shh. Like, look how close he is. Even that shush, as if he wouldn't hear it. Okay, maybe he is deaf. <laughs> <laughs> For feck's sake, <laughs> he's blind and deaf. Oh, take me home, I'm feckin' lost. <laughs> Jesus Christ, end me now. <laughs> go on, Hamani, you get in it. What? Oh, okay, I guess we have to go under there. <laughs> what the hell is he even talking about, and why is he just offering her sacrifice? Okay, so we needed this spell, I guess. Yeah, that's fine. Okay, seems unnecessary, you could just move it out of the way, but you're relying on magic that much? Fair enough. <laughs> you're just gonna get kind of useless as a person. We need to be on the third floor. Yes, I know, we're going there, Ron. <laughs> Oi, stop sneaking around here. You're the one sneaking around. You were behind that feckin' bookcase. <laughs> Creepy bastard. I still don't understand why Lupin can't just be like, look, they were a class. Best get back. <laughs> oh, feck's sake, I'm being attacked. And wh Where's Dumb and Dumber? <laughs> I see Dumb. I don't see Dumber. He's back there somewhere. Stop sneaking around here. Get out. <laughs> I don't know, <laughs> he pisses me off, okay? <laughs> the running man, very good. <laughs> Hermione's a good dancer. Like, they're just standing at the door. <laughs> He's looking right at them and he does nothing. <laughs> oh, finally I made it. Jesus Christ, that was stressful. Now that we've managed to just about sneak through the school, let's go out to Hogsmeade, where it's even more dangerous and we'd get in more trouble. What the hell are those things? Are they the fairies? I need your wings. I need to murder you. Wait, what are you doing here? <laughs> Just feckin' murder them. Come on, you're like a cat playing with a mouse. Just kill it. Oh, great. The three musketeers. Keep out of the way! Thanks for your concern, Ron. Appreciate it. <laughs> feckin' hell. Oh my god, they put a pumpkin on my head. <laughs> Oh my god, how is that Hermione screaming? It sounded like a 50-year-old man. Keep out of the way! <laughs> you see how that feels? It's not nice, is it? Alright, the fairies are in their little fairy bush there. I think this is gonna burn them out of it. <laughs> I think this is like a war crime or something. I don't think I should be doing this. But oh well, burn baby burn. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus Christ, she's brutal. Stop hitting the ones that are already down. Jesus Christ, she's ruthless. I'm even lighting them on fire when they're on the ground now. Give me your wings. <laughs> Sorry. Okay, that was no way an accident. <laughs> Wait, hold on. Harry has this pulling spell. Can I rip him off with that? <laughs> this game is so brutal. All right, if fire didn't work, let's try ice. Oh, good. Okay, that kills them. <laughs> Great. <laughs> they're just watching in feckin' horror as I do this. <laughs> they're not even joining in anymore. <laughs> they won't associate with uh, a war criminal. Okay, we've murdered enough innocents. I think we're good now. Look at her. She just pockets the whole corpse. Okay, this spell isn't working anymore. <laughs> it's not- oh, What the hell? Another one is just replacing him when I get the fr What the hell is this shit? <laughs> How is that gate taking them this long? I don't understand. <laughs> like a while ago, they used a feckin' fire spell just to take down a little sheath cloth. Now they're just banging on it with their fists when it's a fence. Oh my god, Jesus Christ, that was like a jump scare. Feckin' hell. Okay, finally they got through that fence. I'm not even exaggerating, it took like three minutes just for them to open a feckin' gate. This is what I was saying earlier, that if you use magic for too many things, you're not gonna be able to function as a human. For once, I'm hoping Ron says he's exhausted. <laughs> and then we can just go to bed and skip. Oh no, no we can't, we gotta get back. Feck's sake. It's not through there. Why did you have to give us away like that? And why is he going into a coughing fit? <laughs> Snape is easily overwhelmed. You're hiding in the dark and then you're like, It's not through there! <laughs> Just so Snape can find you. Maybe it's through here. Maybe we can sneak away. Oh, I think that actually did make it easier. I think that looped me around him. Alright, none of the rest can escape, but Harry can. That's all that matters. <gasps> Harry doesn't have any grace. He just collapses on his ass. Oh my god, and that's why he got caught. <laughs> See what I mean about blaming the characters? <laughs> Harry's so dumb. Harry, over here. Uh-huh. <laughs> Please talk louder. Snape didn't hear you somehow. Sorry, I can't get to you. <laughs> He's standing like two feet away from him. It's like the in-person equivalent of, oh, I can't hear you. I'm going through a tunnel. You can't see us. <laughs> he believes me. <laughs> okay, good. Uh, I'm an honest chap. I still think this is just badly organized. If they put one person outside every common room, that's all they'd need. And just rotate them. That's fine. <laughs> that's all you'd have to do. <laughs> well, no, they put them wandering random, like, little bookcase areas and stuff. <laughs> 
Oh my god, I thought my night was over, but it's just begun. <laughs> Put those security trolls on the seventh floor, you know. Security trolls? What? Great, they've locked us out of the dormitory. <laughs> For sake. I think that's a fire hazard. They've locked everyone in there. <laughs> oh my god, like, look at this. Seriously, it doesn't make any sense. They would rather a student get murdered brutally <laughs> rather than them causing trouble or being out at night. Oh my god, there's so many of them, and I really don't want to repeat this. I got past two already. Like, how do I get past this one? I don't understand. <laughs> oh, for feck's sake, god damn it. <laughs> These feckin' trolls. <laughs> they are literally trolling me. Like, remember in the first movie when Hermione gets cornered by one of these things, and they absolutely try and murder her, <laughs> but the school's like, ah, oh, it doesn't matter. It won't hurt the kids. <laughs> it's good-natured, really. Hot again. <laughs> oh, this is making it hard to play. <laughs> I'm gonna have that same reaction in a second as they're pounding my chest. We'll stay here. Yeah, I know you will. You'll do feck all as always. <laughs> okay, I think I've got my plan here. So I gotta throw that one there. You run over to it. And then I'll get past you, but I've only got one shot at this, so I'll throw that there. <laughs> he couldn't even see me. There's no fucking way he could have seen me. Why are you coming over here? Oh, okay, now he can't see me. What the hell was that about? He just ran right at me for no reason. He shouldn't be over here. Are you gonna go back, please? He's screwing me over. Okay, okay, I think I'm home free. I think I'm home free. Okay, good. Thank God, that was awful. God, rest the Hermione and Harry. They're not gonna make it through. Okay, they somehow did. No, no idea how. And how did this guy get through? Oh, and finally they get to go to bed. I've never been happier to hear Ron say he's exhausted. <laughs> and for once he actually should be tired. <laughs> Usually he does feck all. He's like, oh, I don't know about you, but I'm exhausted. <laughs> anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed. I hope you're not exhausted from my shenanigans. Appreciate you watching as always. Don't worry, I will remember to save because all that stuff I cannot repeat that. Like, I love these games, but some parts are so frustrating to just repeat it over and over again is too much. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed, and I guess I will see you next time. Bye for now.